Thanks for visiting the patient and the weather today, Saturday, April 1st. I'm meteorologist Al Peterlin. I'll be talking about the weather-related health risk for migraine, mood, pain, and headache for tomorrow, Sunday, April 2nd. We do use a color code on our maps to designate areas of headache risk. The green to blue is a mild risk, yellow to orange is a moderate risk, and the red to purple is a more elevated risk. Tomorrow will be another rather difficult day for those sensitive to weather change. Note that while many of the same geographic areas are talked about each day, the weather is flip-flopping with that much speed. Areas of high pressure and falling temperatures are being replaced by falling pressure and rising temperatures and humidity. While it is a difficult time, it is a time to better, better understand which type of change is more troublesome for you. Moving to the maps, there will be a mild risk of migraine across the state of Nevada tomorrow with falling pressure. And there will be a mild to moderate risk of headache because of falling pressure and rising temperatures and humidity as a new low pressure center forms across the plains and up the Mississippi Valley from Texas all the way through to the Dakotas and from Louisiana north through Minnesota, including uh, Wisconsin and Illinois. And then finally, there will be a moderate to elevated risk of migraine up the eastern seaboard where post-frontal rising pressure and falling temperatures and humidity will stretch from northern Florida through the Carolinas into Virginia, Maryland, and Pennsylvania, and then across New York State through New England. And that takes in the Canadian cities from Toronto to Quebec and on into New Brunswick. Thanks for visiting the patient and the weather today. For today's weather-related health risk and a three-day-ahead forecast of risk, please visit thepatientandweather.com.